Hey guys, it's Cole from Vended, and you're watching Slasher Pepper. Enjoy that shit, motherfuckers. Hey guys, Slasher Pepper, and welcome to another video. Today I will be interviewing Cole from the new band Vended. How are you doing? I'm doing good, bro. Just uh, hanging out, dealing with all this stuff that's going on, and jamming, jamming, and just getting by. Oh yeah, crazy times, man. Oh yeah. Um, so when did you start playing guitar, and what inspired you to? Um, so probably when I was around 13, um, I started actually playing drums and, uh, my dad played drums when he was a kid. So he got me all into music and stuff. And, uh, we were coming home from school one day and he told me he had a gift or like a present for me. And, uh, there was a guitar on the couch. So he just surprised me with that. Um, and I didn't even touch it for like a year. So wow. it, was, it was really weird. But then. After a year, I was just like, screw it, man. I started listening to more music and stuff, and I wanted to try it out. So, uh, yeah, that's how I kind of I started playing. Um, yeah. So what, what did you listen to? And what kind of um, made you, uh, like, what songs did you play first? Like Metallica or something? Or Actually, sort of um, I was more into, like, blues and, and classic, classic stuff when I started out. Um, uh, my, the first song I ever learned was Hey Joe by Jimi Hendrix. Oh, it's, it's good. Kind of, uh, <laughs> yeah. Um, and when I was little, my parents would play the Beatles and stuff. Um, but later on, I did, yeah, get into metal and stuff. There was actually a band called Unlocking the Truth. They're not around anymore, but those guys kind of started getting me into metal. And I kept listening to more and more and just expanding my uh, taste and stuff. So, Awesome. Um, and what's it like working together with Griffin, Simon, Connor, and Jeremiah? Oh, it's great, man. We're all, we're all like a family. Um, the way we write is, uh, just come and jam or maybe one of us will get a riff. It's all collective. Um, yeah, it's just, it's like the perfect group. It took, awesome. it took a while, but we got it. It's a, it's, we work really, really well together. Yeah, I feel like nowadays one of the most important things in a man is is like, you know, keeping it together as a group, you know. You know, what what yeah. what just breaks most bands nowadays is is like the relationship between uh between each other. Oh yeah. We I mean, even outside of band, we're always hanging out, we're always doing stuff. It's like we're a family. It's it's yeah, exactly what you said. That's great, man. Um and how did you think the first Van that show went? Uh, I think it went great. Um, it, it was a lot better than we were expecting. Of course, you know, you have like little stuff go wrong. It's your first show, but we sold it out. We rocked it. We It was it was amazing, man. Um, and a cool little story is uh, afterwards, what was kind of funny is we all went to McDonald's to eat, all the band and all the crew. And we all had our makeup and all of our stage stuff on. So it, we looked like some crazy lunatics coming in <laughs> getting some food it was so funny but yeah it was good it, it, good crowd response good you know felt good but we practiced for about two years before we got to that point so we locked it we really got it down yeah it looked amazing yeah. good energy thank you yeah, so did you did you guys get recognized at the mcdonald's or yeah there there was like two or three guys from the show that came up to us and were like good show it was yeah there was a couple people that must feel rewarding though, like after two years of practicing to have like a good response. Yeah. Uh, and even after the show at the venue, we were talking to a lot of people that came up to us and they were like, great show. We loved it. We're excited to see what you guys do. So yeah, me too. Really cool. Yeah. And, um, what are some of your own favorite metal musicians? Um, band wise, I like, uh, Pantera and, this is not really metal, but Guns N' Roses, because Slash and Dimebag, those guys kind of inspired me to play. Um, I like Gojira. Met those guys a while back. Love those guys. Uh, obviously, Slipknot. Those guys inspire me. I love those guys. Um, Metallica, too. Yeah. But just about any, about anything. I like a lot of music. Those are great. Yeah. Uh, do, you, do you also like Knock Loose? Because uh, yeah. I know Simon and... I think it was Connor like those as well. Oh yeah. Uh, us three, we, we listened to them. We got into them about two years ago, right when they were on their big uprise and 
yeah, we love those guys. Yeah, those we are saw great. them actually two years ago in April. We saw them. They came to Des Moines. They oh, teared nice. it up. It was so cool. They teared it up. How was the crowd response? Oh, it was crazy. There was like three or four mosh pits at the same time. <laughs> uh, JJ even got on the stage and stage dived off the stage. It was so fun. Nice. They they just go so hard, bro. It was, yeah, good band to look out for. Oh, yeah. Um, And what do you think hell looks like? Gee, I don't even know, man. Uh, yeah, uh, I don't know if it's a visual or a physical experience, but I guess it might be like a personal, like, I don't, I have no clue, man. <laughs> That's a, that thought is so overwhelming right right uh where do you hope you and the band will be in 10 years man um 10 years just touring playing having a good time uh releasing music jamming meeting people around the world playing you know i'm sure a lot of people say that but it's just that's what we love to do Oh yeah, Play music. We're, we. I mean, we only played one show so far, so of course, Corona had to hit right when we played our show. Um, but yeah, just play more shows and get out there. Well, my, I hope the band in ten years will have been to Holland, and I, I would have seen you guys oh, live. Yeah. That would be uh, that's that's what my hope is for for the event that future. <laughs> oh yeah, we'll we'll come around there. We'll come around there. Oh yeah, can't yeah. wait to see you guys. Of course, of course. Is maybe anything? we can get a get an interview in Holland maybe. Man, that know. would be like the first uh the first face to face interview. Yeah. Yeah, man. Yeah, I'm excited to get out there. We could we could definitely try and make it to Holland sometime. That would be awesome. Um is there anything you would like to add to the interview? Um, I guess uh keep a lookout for us. Stay vended, man. Thanks Welcome for this to interview. Vended. You're welcome, Thanks man. For having me on here, bro. You're welcome. So uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you next time. See ya. You have waited this long. Hell no longer awaits. <laughs>